Hello, everyone. This is Bogdan Ripa. Today, I'm going to talk about a um, visualizer for GitHub for UiPath uh, XAML files. So those of you familiar with the UiPath products, and especially UiPath Studio, uh, you might know that when developing a, uh, a new automation in Studio, the output uh, of the automation is going to be a, a number of uh, XAML files. And I have here an example. I'm here on, uh, on GitHub, and I have a, you know, a Microsoft auto sign-in. Uh, automation that I built, and it has uh, you know a few a few XAML files as you can see here. So on GitHub now, if I go here under the main file, you will see that I can I can see the contents of the XAML file. But this is not very human readable. This is just an XML representation of my automation. And I really wish you know there were a more a, a better uh, visualization of uh, such files. So um, in the last few days, I worked on such a visualization and I published it as a um, Google Chrome extension. So let's see how we can go about installing it. I first, what I will do is go to the um, Google Chrome store. Um, okay, it's uh, chrome.google.com web store. And in here, I will search for UiPath GitHub. Okay, and I have this extension. It's called UiPath XAML support in GitHub. And I will add it to my Chrome browser. Okay, it can read and change my data on github.com, github.com being the actual website, not the service. Okay, and now the extension was added to my Chrome. And if I go back here in, in GitHub, and if I just refresh this page, you will see that now the uh, the actual XAML file is being represented in a slightly different way. So now what I can do is I can, you know, click on various uh, um, activities here, which are represented just like lines of code. Uh, with every click, you can see here the uh, um, the properties of that activity. So this one, it's a get uh, activity from a it gets a credential, so it gets the secret from the two-factor authentication secret credential located in the FRE folder in my orchestrator instance. And what's, you know, other nice things about it is that you can use your keyboard to navigate uh, through this and even the left and right arrows so that you can, you know, uh, collapse or expand certain, uh, certain scopes. So it makes things uh, uh, easier to, to read. The other thing that this one does is that uh, it also works on the you know, you know on the dark theme as well as on the uh, light theme in uh, in GitHub. So uh, you know whatever your preferred color scheme is, it actually works for you. Uh, the code is obviously for the extension itself. The code is available on GitHub, um, so you can take a look at it. You can uh, you know modify it if you want to. You can fork it. You can uh, uh, you know push back. Uh, uh, your your own uh, your own uh, changes and so on, and that's it. Enjoy uh, browsing through uh, XAML files in a much simpler way.